Brittany Six. I'm here at the 2016 Sundance Film Festival at the Ecolux Lounge with Choices Recovery. And I'm here with Lou Temple here, one of the stars of The Walking Dead. I'm sure you've heard of it. It's one of my favorite shows. Oh, thank you. That's so kind. And to have a fan like you, we're fortunate. We have a lot of great fans. And uh, we like to refer to them as the audience because they're really part of the show. And the family I'm here with, actually, is also quite passionate and fervent is the uh, the horror family of Rob Zombies. And that's all I've heard. My husband knows Rob, Nikki. Oh, husband. right. Of course he does. And I've heard nothing but just the best, best things about Rob and his wife. Tell me about 31. Well, we... He, before we started rolling, you told me, oh, you're not going to like this. You need to stick to romantic comedy. Well, and I just I thought you needed I'm something different in your life. Person. Yes, I know. Um, this movie is mayhem, it's manic, it's it's aggressive, it's terse, so you really don't know victim from villain. The thing I like about the film, of course, is, is all the action and the violence, uh, which can be really invigorating and, and kind of stimulating, but also that when you're put in these situations, you don't know. And I think that's the greatest thing of being human, is you don't know what you might do so it, it's easy to judge until you're put into those shoes is what i'm trying to say well, i agree i couldn't agree more now you've been in the industry for so long you're so sweet and down to earth how do you keep it together like nikki and like rob i've taken good example about being yourself and i think more than anything in today's environment we are all about who are you and i think when you have a better grip of who you are um there's a comfort uh, with your own skin. And you'll realize, you'll come to understand, uh, this is why you're here, be to be who you are. And I've been okay with being able to connect with that and understand what that is. I love tobacco. And when I say tobacco, not a great cigarette, I love chewing tobacco. And I've been quit for a year. And the reality of what it is, it's a fixation well, as they are. That's so I, it was an addiction. And I realized that um, what it was serving was my ego as opposed to serving my, my soul. And I think addictions do that. And so I, I try to hold on to that. Well, you're doing a great job. It was lovely to meet it's you. It's been Thank my you pleasure. So you are delightful. Thank you.